what they have done recently and what they are doing, according to what I have observed, they have said that, okay, in the Boca Haram kidnappings, the kidnappings in Nigeria, now they are very shrewd. They are playing both sides, in my opinion. And this is just my opinion. It can be checked and found out whether or not this is true or false, because it's going to fall in one of two categories, either true or false. That's in everything in counter-racist science. If you're going to be effective against racism, you have to categorize everything that you're going to say. If you're going to say something, you try to make it true. Because if you make any mistakes, uh, it's just like uh, putting a garment together. One mistake can ruin the whole garment. I mean, uh, you, if you have one thread that's loose, because the system of white supremacy is a system very well put together as a well-oiled machine. So I have looked at this kidnapping thing and looked at it from what I call counter-racist scientific, using the scientific approaches, the codified approach, counter-racist code. And uh, it's, it appears that they are playing both sides. In other words, they put up some people to do a kidnapping. The white supremacists are behind this, and that's that's the way I look at it. And then they put up some people to say, let's go get them. Now, this is to do what? What the white supremacists do best, cause confusion. But see, it's all non-white people who are going to get hurt on both sides, both the non-white people who have been uh, bribed or conned or, or propagandized into making the kidnapping. Mm-hmm. See, the white supremacists get behind that and then give them all the arms and money and whatnot and the technical ability to do all of the magic tricks that it takes to kidnap people and, and disappear with it, the whole world looking for them now and can't find them, you know, but they know about them. That's, that should throw suspicion right there. You know, you can't find these fellas and they're supposed to be primitive and backward. They're not super sophisticated. What do you mean? I mean, the the ladies were taken. And they say, well, the jungle is too thick. Oh, they can find a net. The white supremacists are super sophisticated. They can find an alligator's tooth. I don't care where you put it, if they really want to. You have to assume that. They're the most competent people on the planet. But, oh, these boogeymen have appeared from nowhere, like from the planet Mars, with all these AK-47s, shiny boots, uniform, 